Well, hello everybody. Welcome back to the channel. And for the, the, those of you that know the area, you'll know exactly where we are. We're at Pulpit Rock on Portland. And it's a very chilly, but relatively calm, early March morning. And we've come down for something different. We're going to try and catch some wrasse. Just for a change. I'll show you the rig shortly, but basically we're just fishing carp rods, one or two ounce leads, a bit of rag, just for something to do. Just going to fish for about four or five hours, try different marks. It's low water now, so the tide's going to come up. And uh, it looks pretty really lovely. Right, excuse the slightly croaky voice, I've got a dreadful sore throat. Right, let's get at it. Right, three pound test curve, curve carp rod, fixed spool, 20 pound line to a swivel to 20 pound amnesia, just a standoff loop to a size one chinu, to another swivel to 12 pound line to a small weight. That's my rotten bottom. Bait with a little ragworm. Right, off we go. Right then, just touch ledgering really. Nice. Well done, that man. Hey, let's have a look at it. Yeah, nice little ballon rush. Well done. It's not a blank. <laughs> uh, that's what was nibbling all along. Yes. You want his great granddad, really, don't you? Yeah. Excellent. Well, no joy on the bottom bait, so. Onto the float, We've got a stop knot about eight feet, float, weight, bead, a couple of heavy swing, split shot. Oops. Oh, God. <laughs> Typical, always happens. Right. Let's see what that does. Come on, fishies. Berries. 
much more. <laughs> Beautifully marked. That's what's that's what's taking you. That's that's all what's the giving time. me the bites all the time. Yeah. yeah. So how do you get the big ones then? You reckon? Just wade through the little ones. Yeah. Well, we've been fishing for about an hour or so now. Lost a load of gear. Had a lot of bites, but off those tiny little wrasse. And they're just stripping the ragworm off the hook. So I've just found a limpet on the rocks and I've just put that on. That's a lot tougher than the rag. And the rats still like it, so touch wood, we get a better bite off that. Beautiful day now. And there's a strong northeasterly wind, but we're really sheltered from it, so it's glorious. Well, that's what's doing the damage of the bites at the moment. A limpet on the top and a rag beneath it. Although, unfortunately, most of the fish seem to be quite small. But it's good fun, and we're getting bites. Kayak is having fun over there. Come on, nice little limpet for you. Look at the size of that. getting plagued by these. He's a beauty though, isn't he? Yeah, I had it on. I had him on, Chris. The canoeists are struggling with the, or the kayakers are struggling with the swell. Here comes another big one. I'm going to catch him in a minute. Oh dear. <laughs> Don't know. Don't think so. That swell's really getting up, isn't it?
Yeah, time to call it a day, I think. Well, that's it. Our time has come to an end. Enjoyable and interesting, despite the lack of any decent sized fish. But we had a few rafts, but unfortunately nothing of any size. Thanks again for watching, hope you enjoyed it. Oh, a fish now. See you again soon. Take care. Cheers, everybody.